Mm. All right, but like I told you, why do you think I did three push-ups? Because, see, the bar, you know, when you push it up, it's a longer distance. I understand what you mean. Right. But 400 pounds, right, whether you're pushing it up from the ground or you're lifting it from the bar down, right, and back up, right, it's still 400 pounds, right? <laughs> so what I did instead, because I know you're going to be bitchy about it, did it three times, right? Get it? <laughs> So if I'm doing a push-up from the ground and pushing up, right, three times versus one full bar where you push the bar, pick the bar off the uh, holder and then bring it down and bring it, push it back up, right, it's still the same concept of weight. <laughs> the difference is, though, <laughs> I did three push-ups to one bar, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's still 400 pounds though either way <laughs> now um, did I balance it out correctly yeah yeah I know but it's still 200 pounds per arm plus the weight on the back right 350 plus 50 is 400 right now, I can do it again. That's not the problem, right? <laughs> the problem is you want to make something an issue that has nothing to do with anything in particular, right? I know. <laughs> Unless you're just wanting me to do something stupid <laughs> for your entertainment purposes, right? <laughs> and I probably did it, but that's not good enough for you. <laughs> now, right? End. It don't change the fact that I did it. <laughs> Still 400 pounds either way. The difference is you're pushing from the ground then back down. Mm -hmm. Three times. Versus one bar, right, where you push it up all the way once, right? What's the difference? Nothing, nothing. <laughs> In fact, doing it three times is equal to that distance, right? If you were to do it from the chest back up, which is where you got to put the strength into it. Anyone can drop 400 pounds on you, right? It's getting it back up. That's the issue, right? Mm -hmm. And again, if I'm going to do 400 pounds, I got to do it safely. Well, hell, I'm already 300 pounds. I don't know. <laughs> Before you, we started arguing about all that, right? I know. There's just no good way to do it. And I'm basically by myself. So I got to find a spotter who feels they can handle the 400 pounds as well. And that's how that works. You know, even Edster didn't do it without a spotter, right? <laughs> so what I did instead was do three push-ups to his one bitch press of 400 pounds, all right? It's the similar act of pushing from the chest muscle with 500 pounds, 400 pounds of weight on top of it. <laughs> You're just doing what? A push-up. Where the weight is on top of the muscle, right? And you're pushing up like this, right? Instead of pushing the weight up from the arm, right? Like this, right? You're you're just pushing from the chest area, right? Mm -hmm. Three times, right? To equal the one bar, right? Where you're pushing it up, right? And that's about the equivalent of three push-ups. So that's why I did about three push-ups, too, not just one, right? <laughs> Next time I might do six. Who cares? Who cares? <laughs> It's not that I can't. <laughs> it's that you're not happy with anything I do that proves you wrong. <laughs> right? <laughs> you won't admit you're wrong too. And, uh, there's a way to do 400 pounds as a push-up. This is the equivalent to doing it as a mid-trap. Yes, there is. <laughs> 
You just don't want to admit it. <laughs> and then you're stubbornly arguing with me that you're right or I'm wrong or right. Right. After that, that's all it is, is an argument. You just want to argue with someone about who's right and who's wrong and who can do something and who can't. <laughs> <laughs> and like I told you, given enough time, anyone might can be pressed for her to pounds, right? With a safe spotter. <laughs> but just not by themselves. Because the way the weight is distributed is you got 200 pounds on each side. <laughs> mm hmm. And it could decapitate your ass like a guillotine, right? <laughs> Seven it ain't sharp. <laughs> it would hurt like hell. <laughs> right now. <laughs> like on Ridiculousness, <laughs> where the dude almost chopped his head off. <laughs> I don't know. And that wasn't, but probably 300 pounds there. Right. And that's why you don't do something stupid like that with some asshole you don't even know who's just being a smart ass <laughs> about it. And, uh, and won't admit how full of shit he is too. Right. Just gotta be a dick to everybody or he selects who he's a dick to. You know what I mean? Those kind of guys. If you're good with him, you're good with him forever. I mean, yeah, he, he, he's a good guy up to that point. But if he thinks... There's something wrong with you. Right. You'll never hear the end of it. <laughs> He'll always attack you. Right. <laughs> These are the men we need to weed out of our society and work on their behavior modifications because they have behavior issues. Right. <laughs> they hurt people. 